2024 Porsche Macan Electric Prototype First Look Inside the upcoming electric SUV we may have come to understand PPE as one thing, personal protective equipment over the past two plus years, but back in 2018 when Porsche and Audi began developing their own PPE, it meant something entirely different. Four years later, the two Volkswagen Group brand's new premium platform electric modular EV architecture is finally almost ready for prime time. While Audi was the first to preview what PPE would look like underneath the A6 e-tron concept, Porsche invited us to check out the new PPE platform itself and also showed us the early workings of the new 2024 Porsche Macan electric prototype. If what Porsche showed us of PPE is any indication, the new 2024 Macan Electric, it's said to be the electron-powered stablemate to the existing gas-drinking Macan, ought to make prospective Tesla Model Y, Ford Mustang Mach-E, and Kia EV6 GT shoppers think twice about which premium performance SUV they buy. And despite shared parentage with Audi, the new platform is uniquely Porsche in its ethos. It takes lessons learned from today's Porsche Taycan and implements them in a versatile new platform designed to underpin everything from the new Macan Electric to quite likely the new Porsche 718 electric sports cars. Big new battery, fast charging capability Most automakers slice their salami with different motor and battery configurations for different models, but Porsche takes a somewhat different approach. All PPE Porsches, beginning with the new 2024 Macan Electric, will sport new 100kWh battery packs with 800V architecture. Why 100kWh? Porsche says a battery pack this size is the best compromise between range and performance. The 800V quick charging capability, a technology Porsche helped pioneer in the Taycan, will help bridge any perceived range gaps. Porsche says its initial peak charge speed targets for PPE platform vehicles is a little bit higher than the 270 kW rate the Taycan is now capable of and that the Macan Electric can charge from 5 to 80 percent on a 350 kW charger in less than 25 minutes. Given the fact Porsche is investing in a network of public 300 kW chargers exclusively for Porsche owners in Europe, we'd be surprised to see the PPE platform Porsches sport the 350 kW charging rates that 800 volt systems are theoretically capable of. Stuttgart has some tricks up its sleeves for reducing charging times on slower DC fast charging stations, too. The 2024 Porsche Macan Electric's battery pack is capable of what Porsche calls bank charging. This technology allows the car to split its 800 volt battery pack into two 400 volt packs that can charge in parallel, which allows for quicker charging than is otherwise possible. PPE Porsches will also be able to dig deeper into their batteries than the Taycan. Another trick up PPE's sleeve is what Porsche calls its integrated power box. Mounted just below where the Macan Electric's rear seats will be, the power box combines the onboard A-C charger, DC-DC converter, and high-voltage heater in one compact package, reducing weight, complexity, and cost. Porsche says PPE can also be built with varying wheelbases and widths for a wide variety of new vehicles. For starters, it's likely slightly larger than today's Macan SUV, and it sports an aggressive fastback like Roofline, similar to that of its Cayenne Coupe Big Brother. Up front, it boasts a similar headlight configuration to the Jeep Cherokee. The top Taycan style lights are DRLs, the middle lights are headlights that give the Macan Electric a neat rally driving light like effect, and the bottom lights are fogs. The camouflaged prototype sported a grille mimicking decal on the front bumper, but we won't be surprised to see a grilleless bumper there on the production version. Beneath the bumper is a large opening for cooling, with a centrally mounted sensor suite to support advanced driver assist systems. Around back, the Macan Electric appears to have taillights similar to the Taycan Cross Turismos, and it features a pop-out spoiler that emerges from the stubby rear deck. Although the Macan Electric will likely never rival a Rivian R1S in off-road supremacy, Porsche says it will have an off-road solution for buyers who like to venture off the beaten path. Based on the sizzle wheel Porsche showed us, something akin to the now-legendary Cayenne Trans-Siberia could be in the cars. 
The company plans to officially reveal the 2024 Porsche Macan Electric in late 2023 or early 2024, with deliveries beginning sometime in 2024. In the meantime, it says it's working hard on final calibrations and software tuning.